What does that mean? The hierarchy of control. When we want to reduce risk, there is a hierarchy of control to choose from. Hierarchy means an order of preference or ranking. The controls at the top are generally more desirable than the ones at the bottom. Most versions of the hierarchy begin with eliminating the hazard. For example, to eliminate the hazard of a biting dog, we get rid of the dog. The next control type would be substitution, maybe a cat or something less likely to bite. We might consider reducing the risk with a smaller bite and get a smaller dog. Or we could go to the point of danger, the dog's mouth, and prevent contact with this. We might decide to fence our dog in altogether and prevent access to the dog. Or we could decide on a procedure that relies on behaviour, such as only allowing people in when the dog is sleeping. Signage would help to warn people about the presence of our dog and the danger. And our last line of defence would be personal protective equipment. But don't forget we're always trying to reduce the risk as low as reasonably practicable. For help on deciding which control is best, check out our video on the website for ALARP. Um, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to check out our website.